Because we do have, I mean, this world, as we know, we are, we are played with so many kinds of problems, you know, whether it's financial, whether it's poverty, whether it's it, uh, geopolitical conflicts. I know that at the end of the day, we got to use the mind to solve them all. Yes, in fact, if you look at the world and its problems now, mm -hmm. the brain is, for, for, well, when you look, a, look around the world, you see bankruptcy. That's right. All over the place. Mm -hmm. What kind of bankruptcy are you talking about? It can be individuals who are mm -hmm. bankrupt. It can mm -hmm. be small companies, mm -hmm. big companies, nations, you know, the planet going bankrupt. But that bankrupt, or the word bankruptcy, mm. usually applies to finances. Okay. What I am saying is that it's a bankruptcy of thinking. That's right. A and therefore, the planet <coughs> needs to be wealthy. And that's a solution. If yeah. everybody learns how to think and think well, mm -hmm. then they mm -hmm. will learn how to think and how to generate and create wealth. Mm -hmm. In fact, uh, the Wall Street Journal did a survey on the crashing, the depression, the recessions. And they found in their editorial that the leaders of the areas that were going bankrupt were masters of business administration, right. MBAs. So the brain is focusing on administration. Mm -hmm. I am suggesting that it be an MBI or an MBT, mm -hmm. a master of business intelligence. Intelligence. Or an MBT, mm -hmm. a master of business thinking. Mm -hmm. Now I can ask you personally, what degree would you rather have? You know, if you put in your two, three years worth of academic study, would you right. rather have a master of business administration, mm -hmm. or would you rather have a business or a master of business intelligence, or a master of business thinking? What would you rather have? That's right. The answer is so <laughs> obvious, right? Yes.